Game resumed. All right, hey guys, how you going? Uh, this is a duck, and this is Meth Lab, and we are watching a game. Uh, top right hand corner, we have Sem Sem Sam Sam H Sam H. It's Sam Sam H Sam H. So it's like yes. a samurai sandwich maker. No, it's just Sam H. Sam H. Yeah, you're making this a little bit too um, difficult now. I I think I know exactly what I'm talking about. I mean Sam H. Sam Sam A. It's it's not A. Ah, it's Sam A. Sam A. Whatever. Okay. Anyways. Top uh, left. So that's that's top right. Ice Templar is in the top left, in a nice cool blue color. It's very suitable for, for the ice, possibly Templar. Uh, what is this drone doing? Um, he's uh, chilling out. I think he wanted to be an Overlord. Okay. Um, let's just have a look and see if his Overlord goes to no. His Overlord isn't going to go mine. Uh, he'll be watching <laughs> the right hand side. Now the good old extractor trick was performed. Okay. We had I spawn on the bottom left, and you spawn on the bottom right. That's right. So we've got a TZ TZ. Keep this in mind. We are off racing, that's so true. we are definitely not playing well. Mm. That's for sure. <laughs> yes, I'd like to point out that Terran is uh, probably my worst matchup uh, possible. Um, and well. Methlab's doing, doing, doing alright, he's getting well, as high as the APM. Don't, don't hate on us too hard, yeah. because we definitely know we're not playing well <laughs> when we off race. <laughs> we, we it's are, all for fun. We are very clearly Tenoob. Tenoob. Yeah. Look, he's attacking, Sama Itch is attacking you. Oh, that's true. There we go. Oh, oh yeah. that's right. Sweet. Held on oh, just a little bit damaged the SCV. Yeah. Uh, now we also see, if we look to the top left with Ice Templar, he's blocked off his uh, best bean geyser with his spawning pool. Uh, not sure if you know this, but... That's, a, that's efficient right there, man. There's exactly one terrible place for a spawning pool to go. Um, I believe he's found it. Or, well, uh, no, no I, this could help. I mean... If there's a Ling run by, right, and he wants to take down that gas, there's less surface area. You know what I mean? That's true. Mm. Um, maybe maybe that's what he's thinking, you know? This is a better game type of thing. Yeah, so, some might consider the hatchery much more... Uh, much better to protect, but... It's uh, not a, yeah. not a big well, problem. That's a lot of Lings. Three, six Lings coming down. Looks like they're going to... Maybe see if they can do some damage. Mm, and I don't uh, think Metlab saw that the uh, drone was actually just above. But I don't. I can't see this. The queen's about to pop anyway. So, I mean, unless there's a major mistake happening. Oh look, a marine's attacking a duck's depots. Uh, there's his king could do a lot of damage. Um, you never know what who's living in those houses. Uh, but we see the uh, pressures finally come. Uh, not target firing the. That's, very, that's actually very good placement from MathLab. Sitting in, sitting in Queen right between the mineral lines. Uh, very impressive. Um, always good, always good to make sure there's a bit of a bit of defense going on, especially when there's a uh, spine crawler trying to build in the base. Well, look at this. He's already behind in workers so. now. Mm. Look at that. He's. Yeah, if we look at the units tab, we've got 20, 20 from a duck, and eight and twenty from Methlab to twenty-one to fourteen. Uh, it's not a um, not the kind of uh, drone count you you want to be after. Not really, no. And uh, a couple of marines picking off some uh, picking off some Zer uh, Methlab zerglings. It's a good uh, good defense actually. Nice that uh. Terran's got a couple of marines to spare. I have a craving for some chicken right now. Uh, I'm, I'm just... I'm telling you, you know? it's like 12.30 at night, and uh, the food urgings is pretty high. It is quite high at this time when there's nothing else to do except eat and play games, right? I mean, yeah. Like, what else? What else do you do? Well, you could sleep, but that's not eating, so... That's true. I, I really want some chicken. Oh, man. It'd be 
be so good. I mean, you know, it's not, not nearly as tasty as, as duck, but, you know, what can you do? I don't know, man. Chicken's pretty good. Look, Ice Templar only has 15 workers, so I feel like... What, how many things are on... Oh, here we go. He's got a lot more workers now. Mm. 22. Ni nice, nice to give himself that bit of a kick. Mm, but uh, he needs more workers at this point in the game. He does have a lot of things though, so that leaves it open for some aggression. Uh, he's, he's getting a, a roach horn at the moment. Um, not sure what this move is, or not sure what, how good a move this is considering he's got his two evo chambers up here. Uh, they're just a bit too soon. Uh, I think he should be really focusing on recovering from his uh, from his economy deficit at the moment. It's just just not doing so good. Yeah, it's definitely not doing so well. Uh, he needs his saturation is not good enough for what it should be at this point in the game. Um, what do we have here? Got a lot of units actually for Sama itch. Sama itch. It's got a nice little uh, infantry force. Four idle workers, which is not efficient. Uh, it's currently getting a lot of production up. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and six barracks. A uh, starport and a factory. Um, interesting choice. Not sure how well he'll be able to fund this, but uh, uh, we'll see how this goes. Yeah, well, he's moving out. Uh, some itch. I think he's just looking around, see what he can pick off. Uh, he's got to be careful though. Just doesn't want this army to get stuck in the middle of the map and then just die. Look, I mean, there's a lot of there's banes on the way, lings on the way. I mean, like he's he's he doesn't have the medevac, so he can't quickly pick up whenever he wants to. Mm. So um, that's, those, that's those medevacs are coming now, and they could actually put on a bit of pressure to. Uh uh, if he goes for a couple of drops, that would really be uh, very helpful for him. Well, it's, yeah, it's alright he should go um, take out some creep, because he can just pick up whenever he wants to, so he's got these medevacs. And there's no anti-air for Zerg right now. Uh, so, I mean, it's, he could definitely do that. Um, I'm not sure what he's planning to do with these units, though. He's got them parked right here, and nothing's happening. I feel like at the moment he's more focusing on defending his uh, Zerg ally, uh, which is a very generous move considering he uh, hasn't been doing so well. Mm, the uh, Zerg is still behind in workers, uh, 42 workers. Now we so do yeah, we do see a drop coming in the right-hand corner. Uh, we're just going to see how what's the uh, problem with all these... Oh, here we go. Well, there's no units at home. Oh, oh. there's absolutely nothing. Quick, quick, that's a quick response though, quick SCV response. Certainly, but it's still potential to do some damage here. Alright, going straight, oh look, he's, this is actually, this. if he doesn't lose this drop, it's paid for itself. He's made, look at all that loss of money time. Oh. He just didn't quite pay attention to him. Yeah, yeah, he's actually killed quite a few workers now. He's coming back with his army, but I mean, a duck can just quickly get out of here. He can actually just pick up and leave. Yeah, see, that's that's what he picks up and leaves. So yeah, this is not going well for. Oh, a bit oh, of a probably not drop the best. Get out. Yep. Oh, he'll get out of here just fine. Um, I think that work, that drop, definitely paid for itself. Uh, Got to be careful. Uh, six hundred minerals lost, or six hundred resources lost. Um, How many workers were killed then? I don't think we can check in this, unfortunately, but, um, uh, so it's currently not, not producing any workers. I think he's a bit, uh, bit on tilt at the moment. Yeah, he, that, I think that, or, yeah, that, I think that, sort of messing with his macro a bit, he's just a bit all over the place at the moment. He's got his medivacs following a duck's medivacs. Which, uh, you can't really pick up other players' medivacs. Um, I think that's it's probably not the best place to go to. Um, I mean, if you really want to try and pick up another flying unit, it's not you know. I wouldn't say it's the best thing to do. Not a not a really good not a strong strategy in my opinion. But um, uh, we'll see how that turns out for him. Summer itch army moving out. I think after that he was looking to do some damage, which he definitely should be doing. 
Uh, he is a bit supply blocked at the moment. I do not know if he's realized because there's no supply depots in production right now. What do you think? I uh, no, it looks I like think he's, he's a bit focused on this attack. Uh, he should not be attacking this planetary, this is a bad move. Yeah, get out of here. No, he's got he's to be careful though, he's... Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. We do have a uh, tank being produced, it looks like he uh, managed to unsupply block himself. But he's still got no supply depots in production and he's... Oh, Still a bit. Oh, look, we got a bridge yeah. force coming down. This could do some damage. And oh, that's a nice. That's an interesting move. This creep has creep has gone up into into where the base would be and forced him to walk, walk upwards. Mm. Um, uh, yeah, we might get this base. I don't know. Oh no, that's the. This is a bit dicey, actually. Yeah, didn't target. Oh, didn't target fire the hat. So that oh, is going to be it's gonna lose. Yeah, here comes a dart. Uh, he's not going to be able to. Uh, but we like, do have this counter attack at the right hand corner, which, which I believe he was expecting to hit just as the roach is hit, which is good yeah. timing. Mm. Uh, he has got himself in a good position with this trade point, though. Yeah. That's, this could potentially do some damage, but uh, I don't know. I feel like uh, it might not be enough. Yeah, not, not a great engagement from that there. Not the best idea, but well, so we got a coming out with the flank. Flank. Yeah, so this army is going to get cleaned up, I think. Obviously, it's not very cost efficient for Zerg, but uh, Lings are pretty expendable. Yeah. Ah, oh, oh. Two full meta ah, that's painful. There's two Vikings just putting that additional punch, but again, we see the Zerg pushing out. Mm -hmm. uh, those, those roaches are uh, looking to do some serious damage. A lot of muters as well. Yeah, that's a big muter count. He's gonna if he can snipe this hatchery, that's actually quite a good way to get back in the game. There we go. Uh, he does snipe it. That's painful for Method Lab. Yeah. Okay, these meters are still chilling out, just waiting for the best mode to start. Hmm. Uh yeah, Nudo is still chilling out. Here we go. Looks like they're about to do some serious damage. They are still lacking in the drone count. Only 46 and 48 workers for Ice Temple and Samurai Itch. Whereas a duck has 57, plus 4 mules, and Methlab has 70 drones. So they, their economy is definitely not as good as it could be. Uh, but we're seeing these, uh, these mutilists being very pesky. Mm. Uh, Picking off some drones there. Yeah, actually focusing down the medibacks. I'm not sure that's the best idea to do at the moment. Uh, those Vikings can be putting out quite a bit of a hit. Mm, oh. Well, taking down Viking uh, medivacs is a pretty good idea. Because they are very expensive and you can't be making Vikings and medivacs at the same time. That's true. Not easily, anyways. But yeah, that, um, he actually took out eight of Methlab's workers there. So that was okay, but he did lose too many beaters, a bit too not, many. Not entirely sure that was qu a good trade considering he's lost. Mm. Over, it looks like he's lost about 10 muters for the trade. Yeah, and considering his economy is not that great, I don't feel that it might it might not have been worth it. Mm. If the roaches went in by themselves, it looked like that would have been a, a much stronger move and just threatened with the uh, muters. Mm. Uh, but we'll uh, we'll see how that turns out for him a bit, a bit later on. Uh, we've got actually got quite a few uh, workers that aren't be, that aren't doing anything for Terran. Mm. You mean Summer Itch? Summer Itch? Summer Itch? Summer Itch. Yep. Oh, this is a big force coming from a duck. Uh, this may... Oh, there is oh. a mech army. Oh, mm. that's second bit of damage there. Not doing so yeah. hard. Yeah, taking quite a few volleys there. But, you know, these... He does have 2-2. These tanks are not upgraded at all. So that is a factor. We do have Methlab's army moving up on the right-hand side as well. Uh, mm, this is a bit of a yeah. Um, this is very oh, in the flank. This is not very cost efficient. Uh, oh, he might lose this. No, he, he boosts out of there really quickly. He might be able to save some of that, but that was not. That was a very poor move. A duck's uh, supply plummeting down a little bit, but we do have quite a few ultras now coming up. 
Do you reckon this army can take on both these armies? Uh, those mutilists are going to be a bit pesky. With a bit of micro, he might be able to take off quite a few banelings. Mm. Uh, however, the sheer force of the ultras will just do so much damage. Mm. They had some roaches going in a, not a very good direction. Not quite, a, not quite a good surround to the ultra uh, for the uh, for Metlo. Uh, mm. uh, however, it's uh, a bit of just harass at the, uh, harass at the time. Uh, what have we got at the moment? Uh, a ducks, a ducks moving out again. Uh, is he going to make the same mistake? It's um, he may not actually. We've got a we've got a displaced force from Sam Edge. A uh, lot of scans going uh, down. Sam yeah, Sam Edge is a bit out of position here. You might be able to snipe this, snipe this and get out of here. Yeah, exactly where it does. But that, that is pretty good. Um, that's really painful right now because he's barely mining. I mean, he's got these two bases, but they're running out of minerals really quickly. So that planetary was, losing that planetary is very painful. Even if we got a engagement on the left hand side of the map, that's lab going against Ice Cluster. Could be some damage done if you can snipe that hatchery and get out. I don't even think he has to get out since these roaches are uh, not going to be much of a match for the ultras. The roaches are using a lot of shots on their wings as the ultras close in the kill. Yeah, the lings are there to buffer a bit of the damage. Oh, but the tanks there, yeah, the fab should definitely get out of there. But taking down that hatch is uh, also quite good. Here we go, the Terran army is getting out of place. Yeah, a duck going in for a snipe. This could potentially be... Oh, that's very good actually. Very good for a duck. Um, he took out two planetaries now, and these he really needs these bases. Samage really needs these bases. Yeah, Terran's currently working off two bases, and these bases yeah. are off a very nearly uh, mined out. Two, two base mech is really, well, it's mostly mech, but two base um, mech and bio with Thors and that, you really can't really keep that going off two base. It just, just doesn't have enough room to maneuver. Um, it's, he does have a lot of tanks though, and that's going to be bad for the uh, tank force. Yeah, well, one bad engagement from a duck, and he could lose his whole army. Oh, good meta. Uh, would have mine hit right there on the meters. You will actually see quite um, these mines doing a lot of damage. There's not too many of them around, but they're scattered around just in the right places. Just to uh, just to put them put them a bit off guard. Yeah, and it's quite it makes him uh, use up scans, which you really shouldn't you be using for mules since its economy is so bad right now. Mm. Uh, uh, that's a lot of ultras from um, uh, from Ice Templar. That's that could, that's a quite a scary force. However, his yeah. upgrades aren't. Um, yeah, his upgrades aren't the best right now. Uh, so uh, this will be I don't know this will depend on the engagement actually. Uh, it depends on the angling. Obviously the tanks there will be very good for the long distance and so they can be dealing the damage while these ultras kind of shield up. Here we go, we've got an engagement. How is this going to go? Oh, no, this, oh, this is that, crazy. That gun is well placed. Very well placed. Now the fire, of course. Yeah, this, ooh, this is actually quite painful for Nestlam and the Duck. These tanks have not died. Only one ultralist left. Down. Yeah, this is this is not going well for this is probably the best thing the best engagement Ice Templar and Samage could have taken right now. Um, we've got another expansion coming down, but I think it needs to expand in the other area as well, opposite that. Oh we've got a bit of harassment at Metro's yeah. north base. Mm -hmm. But this is a big this is a very big Terran force, considering he's going to go low force. Well, there's seven broodlords on the way, and there's no anti air. How do you, this, this is going to be a rough transition for Sama Itch to deal with. It's certainly going to, it's certainly very unusual considering the, uh, the usual force of just Thors and what seems to be um, Ultras. There's, we have a bottle. We do have a bit of a uh, we, yeah. We do have a lull. Uh, what was that for? What uh, happened? I'm not sure. I think he's just really happy that he's got all of these ultras out. Yeah, I think he's laughing a little bit. This uh, this base is gonna get cleaned up. But we're about to see one of the serious engagements around. Mm. 
Oh, well, these three guys. These three guys. Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure if this is the best engagement to be honest. Well, they desperately need some anti-air right now. Uh, or oh, losing all those bandings yeah, into ultras, that's painful. Uh, interesting, interesting burrow actually. There's a roach that's kind of burrowed underneath the army. He's going to yeah. be doing yeah. a bit of scouting. Well, it's the hero roach. He might be able to take down entire bases. Songs will be sung. Oh look, here we got a drop on the right hand side. Uh, I can't see it taking down the planetary, but just being pesky, I think that's the point. Oh, Look at this, taking out Ice Templar's base. They said they just have no answer for these Broodlords. Yeah, these Broodlords are raining down. It seems like it's getting to be a bit of a winter really match as opposed to a part of the swarm. Well, they're finally making Corruptors and Vikings, but it might be a little bit too little too late. Uh, these Corruptors are oh, actually the Corruptors on both sides of 1 1. Oh, sorry, uh, not 0 1. So I think it's going to do the same amount of damage either way. Mm. Um, these are the Marines from, uh, from the Dark are going to put them up as well. Uh, they're going to town on these Corruptors. Damn. Uh, so three, three, three Marines are just so brilliant. Mm. That's the end of the This. We got bases going down. I feel like they cannot recover from this. They're not mining very much. The army, the expensive army, is pretty much dead. Yeah, Suiciding Viking. the Vikings, suiciding the Corruptors, not going well at all. And we got a GG. Yeah, I can't see this. I can't see this. It'll have to be an amazing comeback. <laughs> comeback of the year if they managed to come back from this. Yeah, so we've currently got one base point. So that is about uh, to well, we do have a planetary which is mining, but I'm not uh, sure how that's long that's going to last. Ah, uh, that poor, that poor marine just got flung into the air because his commander told him to run straight at the planetary fortress and see what I can do. Fun times. Yeah, that's uh, turned out to be um, not a bad match. Bit of back and forth. Uh, yeah. Bit of a hive and. Hatcheries covered in overlords because you never want those satellites to see where your bases are. Mm. Uh, but uh, yep, hope you guys enjoyed that one. Nice, uh, nice very game. Good to see. Uh, good to see some. Uh, uh, not no bio mine action this game action. So. Too bad. I love some bio man bio mine action. Yeah, has a zerg you can go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, I'm playing so this game. That's true. So that you should, yeah, you would have known to absolutely hate it. But yep, that's it for that's it for us. I'm a duck, and I am really hungry. <laughs> Good night. Right. Bye bye.